Hello everyone. Uh, as I remember, for the first video, I wanted to simulate effect of Reynolds number by cylindrical surface in airflow. Flow velocity was increased, and with it, Reynolds number was increased also. Case A and C were represented in the first video. Today I simulate case D. It is a turbulence case and after this I compare additional two turbulence models. First turbulence models is Reynolds Average Average Never Stocks R I N S model. I go back in my model and change the velocity to 10,000 mm per second. Change the end step, time to 0 0.8 second. And start calculation. After a long time, calculation is finished and I can view the results. You don't see? Not so much turbulence. You can see I bit in the streamline. The reason for this is that the physics of fluid is modeled, not resolved, in the R RINS turbulence model. The advantage is that the calculation time is shorter than with the other turbulence models. For comparison, I changed the turbulence model to the hybrid. Detached eddy simulation, the DAS model, it is a modified RINS model. By DIS, is the physique is more resolved. In physique model, I change from RINS to DAS. And start solving. You can see turbulence directly. I change the color map to rainbow. And start animation. Make visible streamline from velocity. Here too we can display turbulence vorticity. For this we need a filter gradient. Scalar array U and compute vorticity active.
coloring of vorticity, change the range from 0 to 5000 on start animation. Here is uh, another comparison of the vorticity uh, between RINS and DES turbulence model. Here is the overview of turbulence models. You can see that from bottom to top the degrees of freedom increase, then computational cost increase also. Uh, but the resolution of physique decreases from top to bottom. From computational cost in industrial the RINS method or hybrid RINS are more to be used. I think DIS as I got balance between computational cost and physical resolve. So summary of results: case A, B, C, D, and associated vorticity. Thanks for your attention. See you next time. Bye-bye.